about a story to make you hungry here as we go toward the lunch hour and beyond. Speaking of, it's a good day to eat lunch outside. Check out these temperatures as things have turned out pretty nice with that sun returning for many of us, but not all of us. Check it out as you go to the south and east. That's where temperatures are getting closer to 80 through DC, the southern Maryland back into northern Virginia, but cloud cover has kept it a little bit cooler as you go to the north and west. Still 65 in Cumberland, 68 in Hagerstown. So yes, we have a good spread of temperatures so far here on this early Monday afternoon. One thing is for certain, though, it's fairly breezy in most locations, anywhere from 10 to close to 20 miles miles an hour Martinsburg with a steady wind speed of 22 right now and this breezy westerly wind is going to stick with us. There are the wind gusts we've measured so far here today up to close to 30 miles an hour back across western Maryland and West Virginia. Not as windy but still breezy as you go to the south and east. Now yesterday we saw a good bit of rain and storm activity. There's not as much today, but a couple of pieces of energy are throwing a couple of light showers across the eastern panhandle and western Maryland with plenty of cloud cover to the east. It's staying dry and likely will stay dry, but as that low pressure center spins away to our north, we could see some cloud cover making it all the way over to the Chesapeake Bay as we move throughout the rest of this Monday. So there you have it across the DC Metro, a good mix of sunshine and cloud cover temperatures mid to upper 70s. Not all that bad for late September. Again, it will be a bit breezy, but rain chances are pretty much zero as you go across the I-95 corridor into southern Maryland as well. That's where those temperatures could reach and already have reached the 80 degree mark in a few spots like Lexington Park. And then as you go back toward Fredericksburg, pretty much looking at the same forecast. Now temperatures then start to fall off a little bit as you go west through northern Virginia. There you go closer to those upper 70s near Gainesville and Manassas, but lower 70s toward Woodstock Front Royal and back up through parts of Clark County, including Boyce across the four state region. Generally, we're going to have dry conditions and a good bit of sunshine, but like we just saw in the satellite picture, some clouds will roll in from the west and we will have some light rainfall, especially as you push back toward Berkeley Springs inwood, and then as you go more into the mountains of West Virginia and Western Maryland, that's where we've already had some light rain showers and certainly some cooler temps. It may not get out of the 60s, if not the 50s, as you get into those highest elevations of Garrett and Allegheny counties. So a little bit of a spread with the forecast today, but things will level off as we cool down and have a good bit of sunshine through the middle of this week with Canadian high pressure locked in place and it does stay quiet straight through the work week, but then we're keeping a close eye on this weekend as what's left of Hurricane Ian could roll in and at least bring us some rainfall, especially late Saturday going into Sunday.